Harry and Meghan not handed $100 M by Netflix despite claims about deal sum. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have not have been handed the $100 million their deal with Netflix is speculated to be worth, as the deal figure is a not quite the whole picture a source has claimed. After quitting royal duties back in 2020, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex pursued a number of commercial opportunities. Meghan and Harry launched Archul Productions in autumn of that year to produce programming that informs, elevates, and inspires. They signed a deal with Netflix to create a number of different types of programs including documentaries and children's TV shows. While no specific sum has been revealed, it is speculated that the deal is worth around $100 million, £72 million. However, a Los Angeles-based TV and film consultant, who has worked with Netflix on projects, understands that the $100 million deal figure is a not quite the whole picture. They claim that Meghan and Harry would not have been handed $100 million, and instead the sum they receive up front is more likely to be a couple of million. This sum is expected to be used to produce ideas, concepts and film pilots. The entertainment source noted that Meghan and Harry would have needed to provide a breakdown of fees for all aspects of the making of the show and a broad understanding of the profits Netflix would make. The Sun quotes the source as saying, on the surface, this large sum seems enormous, but the truth is that their deal is all about budgets when shows get commissioned. Sure they may have a couple of million in an advanced development deal to produce ideas, concepts and film pilots, but they have not been handed 100 million. In reality those sums would be handed over to cover the entire production cost of the project, with Archul providing a breakdown on fees for all aspects of the making of the show. Included in that would be a broad understanding of the profits too for the company. Some deals see companies achieve as much as 20% of that total, while others can earn half that figure. Every deal is different. But fees for writers or executive producers, like the Duke and Duchess, are often specific amounts outlined in production budgets. Harry is serving as executive producer for a documentary called Heart of Invictus. It follows competitors who took part in this year's Invictus Games, the sporting event for military servicemen and women launched by the Duke in 2014. This year the Games took place in The Hague after being cancelled for two years due to the pandemic. Meghan and Harry travelled to the Netherlands to attend and were pictured taking part in different activities, delivering speeches and interacting with those competing. Meghan, on the other hand, was due to serve as executive producer for an animated series with the working title Pearl. However, the project was among a number of titles scrapped by Netflix recently as part of cost-cutting measures. Pearl was still in its development phase and was axed alongside two other animated kids shows Dino Daycare and Boons and Curses. The shutdown of the shows comes at the end of the week when Netflix suffered a massive subscriber loss, the largest in more than a decade. The company also laid off about 25 people across its marketing operation and cancelled its comedy space force after two 